quite a little video in Longfeld. Three ladies up there just rescued a lamb trapped. I mean, these lambs are smaller than the ones I've got. I mean, the ones I've got rescued have usually got quite big horns. She rejected him. I don't normally have three. Um, his mum might be following on behind, you know. That might not even be his mum. You told him off when he got caught up there, didn't you, mum? Hey, eh? See, there's one following on there. Yeah, you got caught, didn't you, little lamb? Hey, eh? No shit, that might not be your mummy. That might not be your mummy. Christmas, knows how long you've been there. She's not letting you have a drink. Where are you, Mum? She so says that's not my mum. Well, she could be anywhere now. Hey, where's your mummy gone? Where's your mummy? It's a beautiful day. This 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 sun is so warm. They really look shaggy though the sheep at the moment, the mums. Look, there's one. He's gonna get your horn stuck in that fence again. Come on. You stop it. You get stuck. Oh, you've had, you've lost all your hair. You're all right. Somebody's got to own one of those lambs there. Come on. Come on, you mustn't get stuck. Come on. No. Come on. Hey, look at the state of you. My goodness. What a fashion parade you are! Look at you! Let's turn off a minute so I can put... Right, just come through the nice little... We have a couple of little tiny stiles for Piney Slates Farm. And, uh... It's a bit breezier now. It's a nice cool wind. I had, did have my hat on for a period going through Long Sheepfield. Um, I've just taken some pictures of that scene there with the tree I always think's nice. I take some zooming in ones. It's a lovely big tree that, isn't it? So I said there's some gorgeous trees. There's some gorgeous trees that I speak to. So anyway, I've got no idea whereabouts the cows are. I can still see the wild goats, cheddar goats. Right over there, look. There's loads of them. I have seen one cow. But there certainly are a lot of goats this year. Of course, if we zoom around quick and slow at the same time, we come to the gorge. The gorge, which I was on earlier. I was on there earlier. And of course, as everyone knows what I'm going to say next, I have videoed this so many times. I love this. When I, if I, if I just lie back, say I can't sleep or I'm feeling a bit low, I can just put myself walking across this field in the warm sunshine. There's, there aren't many wildflowers here at the moment, but this is one of the places, or, or going through Longwood. There's loads of places I go, but this is one of them. In a big open space. Walking across a beautiful field in peace, no people, no hassle, no stress, no nastiness, just me and the grass and the wind and the, the 
lovely smells all around me, all not giving me allergies, not giving me acrylamide attacks, not giving me an asthma attack. Natural smells and chemicals that are natural. The wind in my hair, cooling my face. I just, I just love this place. There's a few uh, dandelions about. Well, that's some um, Piney Slates Farm. I'm leaving that now. They've been doing a lot of new fencing, I've noticed. So I don't know what they plan. They might even plan to have cows in there. Um, or to stop people climbing the walls. A lot of the walls need repairing. It's a big job. I noticed over Black Rock there were some National Trust people doing some repairs. Right, at the moment, I mean, I definitely seen one cow, right, down there somewhere. Unless it was an ultra big goat. I can see goats up there. But, of course, if there are cows, they'll have calves. And as we all know, you've got to keep away from cows with calves. Even this past Sunday, someone's been trampled. Had to have been airlifted. Not quite sure where it was, but... The farmer's going to have to start putting up the fence in. People should still be able to walk in the countryside without thinking they're going to be trampled to death. And, uh, right, I'm going to turn off for a minute. Put my hat on. Right, another small video. Just about time to do a small one. I'm coming down from Piney Slights now. Left the farm, came down. Um, seen somebody walking right up there a minute ago and then you've got this purple haze in this field see and it was just uh, lots and lots of bluebells in here I just start zooming away from them and then you can see purple haze That's a lovely tree. Hello tree, aren't you beautiful? With another one next to you. Very pretty. Now another reason for coming this way rather than hugging the wall by the gorge on the north side is, is um, shade. On hot days, shade. And a gentle breeze. And peace. Most of the visitors don't know all these little pathways it takes them a few visits and they might never come back you know but um, they all go down there because they want to see that side of the gorge well I've you know sometimes I'll zoom in with the lens near the end and get a, just one little picture of it but, yeah, so you can have your videos uninterrupted and I haven't seen any big goats I don't know where they're hanging out but uh, in a shady place somewhere. They often come in here, like big goats, but they've got enough places to hide, to call. And, uh, yeah, because it's half term, you will get like noisy people about. They can't help it. When you've got a load of kids, if I was to come out with my grandchildren and my and my kids, my kids, they would be talking, laughing, smoking, joking. Um, now they're all older, you know, we, they wouldn't be a quiet little group. See? So I make the most of it. I make the most of it. I needed this walk today. Oh. I tell you one good thing when I went to stay with my daughter, one of my daughters, I was able to have a bath for the first time in two years because when I moved into my flat there were, I've got a nice big wet room if you like uh, shower room it, there's no bath I do actually like a bath I do if I had choice I'd have my bath in there I'd have a bath in there don't know how much it would cost to get one fitted or if I'd be allowed but uh, 
not to worry, I've got a shower, I've got showers. And I can always have a bath again. <laughs> I'm just going to zoom into Glastonbury Tour because that'll be going out of view soon. I did take a picture of it. It's been hazy all day. Getting as far as we can. It might um, come out of the clouds in a sec. There we go. Glastonbury Tour. No real festival this June. They've had a festival on Zoom or something, you have to pay to view it online. Not the same as it as the field, which only costs a pound to go in. Simple life. There might be another chance to take a picture of it when I get down here, actually. I'll open up my new water. That'll be the third bottle today, and I needed it. I haven't overdrunk, but I've drunk enough. If you know what I mean, I haven't like deprived myself of fluids. Three bottles, I've spread them out so that I have them. The first one was, I didn't allow myself to drink it until I got halfway up the gorge. And then uh, spread the others out. So there's the gorge over there, look. Which I was standing on and looking down like some people are now, that are probably up there or having their picnics. There, yeah, look at that big group of people. All under the shed, in the shade. Being sensible. See, lots of people. Some have just done the gorge walk. I've done the um, Longwood. I, d I went up there on that side. I'm over on the north side, but I'm not walking close to the gorge. <laughs> Depending what the time is when I get down to this path in a minute, will determine which way down I go. Because I do want to get a cold drink and an ice cream. I'm videoing like I've done thousands of times. I still reckon there's another way down, you know, that I, I've done before now. And it's over there somewhere. I've done it with Roy. Here we go. I'm not going this way. I'm just coming just through here for a minute. See if I can see the tour again. Yeah. There's the tour again. Through there, look. Glastonbury tour. Where I want my ashes scattered when I go. So I've got good views of my Somerset from up there. Right, over and out everyone. Take a picture.